Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new, welcome. My name's Natalie and I do videos on handbag reviews, unboxings, anything luxury related. So if you like that kind of content, please consider subscribing. I'd love to have you back. So in today's video, I'll be doing a very, very belated what I got for Christmas type of video. And I know I'm really late to the bandwagon on this, but as you saw in my previous video, I've been so busy this past six months that I haven't even had a chance to sit down and film a video. And you guys know I really, really love Christmas. It's my favorite time of the year, so I really want to do at least one video Christmas themed. And so I thought a really special video to do would be what my husband got me for Christmas last year, so in 2022. Last year in November, Anthony and I got married. And yeah, it was just really special. I'll do a video, like a wedding video coming up shortly. But yeah, it was our very first Christmas together as husband and wife. And it's still really weird to this day to call Anthony my husband. It just feels like I just feel very old now saying that I have a husband. But yeah, anyway, it was our very first Christmas together. And he actually got one of my old advent calendars and filled them up with little trinkets and little things that he knows that I really, really love. And by the way, if you hear Ellie, like, She's, she's fast asleep. Ellie's my little Jack Russell Parsons Terrier and she often joins me in my videos but she's just resting on her bed now so if you hear her sighing or yawning or anything like that in the background that's just her. So anyway so yeah Anthony actually got me a few little things but then he also sport me with something else which I was not expecting at all so I just wanted to share with you guys what he got me. He actually got me this well, he didn't actually get me this advent calendar but he used this advent calendar of mine so this is actually from Stalvana that I got a couple of years back and it's got all these drawers in here and it's so heavy so that's why I've decided to sit on the floor for today's video so I think it might be easier to pop it up here so I can show you guys as I unbox it so open it up and it's just beautiful this advent calendar Stalvana do amazing advent calendar so I would highly recommend checking out the advent calendar for this year for Christmas. The value for money is amazing and also the sturdiness of the boxes and the drawers you could definitely reuse for years and years to come. Okay hopefully you can see all that so I'll start with drawer number one. Here we have a hand cream so this is by Frudia and this is the My Orchid Cactus hand cream and you might see a theme in this video of like hand creams because Anthony knows that I love hand cream. I use it multiple times a day and I just love popping them in my bags, especially like these smaller size ones or just having it at my desk or in the office. I just, yeah, reach for these so, so much. Just because I do suffer from eczema, like on my hands especially, I get really dry hands and yeah, I just need to keep them hydrated, especially after washing them multiple times a day. So day two is just down here. And in here we have an Innisfree Bija and Tea Tree Capsule Recipe Mask. And yeah, this is really cute. So he knows I love Innisfree as well. So he got me this little face mask. Number three, we have a shower gel. So this is from L'Occitane and this smell is amazing. If you guys haven't tried the rose shower gel or hand creams by L'Occitane, definitely check it out because it just smells so, so good. And this is such a perfect size for travel. So number four is just over here. And here we have another hand cream. So this is also by Fridia. And this is my Orchid Raspberry Hand Cream. So number five is just up here. And in here, this was so cute. So this is a little Friends trivia set. And I absolutely love Friends. I've been re-watching all the episodes over and over again constantly. So Anthony knows that I love Friends. And it's just like cute little trivia questions and I love the images of it because it's like a little Polaroid photo like the old school Polaroid photos and then at the back it just has the answers even just like going through these when I'm bored or just want something to laugh at I can kind of just go through these and yeah it's really cute the little Polaroid photos so drawer number six is just over here and this is a shower gel from L'Occitane but in the cherry blossom scent and I also really really love this. This is really sweet so if you don't like something too sweet I would highly recommend checking out the rose scent. This one is really nice though and it's also in the cute little travel size. So number seven we have another hand cream so this is by Fridia again and this is the My Orchid Cherry hand cream. So number eight is just over here and this is really cute too. So this is another trivia set but this is Sex in the City theme. So I also really love Sex in the City and Anthony knows that too. I've rewatched the whole series and yeah this is another trivia set which is so cute and it fits perfectly in this little drawer. Like I wouldn't even think to get this as a gift or like an advent calendar like I would just think to fill it with chocolates and lollies but he's actually been so thoughtful and thought thought about every single day and what I actually like practical and something fun for me to use as well so yeah this is really sweet so it just looks like that and each of the cards 
I like that. So number nine is just down here and here we have another hand cream. So this is the Shea Butter one that I used previously. So I haven't opened this one yet. As I mentioned, there's a lot of hand cream in this, but I'm not mad about it because I really, really love hand cream and it will get used and especially in these travel sizes. Number 10 is just up here. Okay, there's nothing in this one because it was actually a little chocolate. So you know the Kinder Surprises? I don't know if that's an Australian chocolate, but it's like the little egg and then when you eat the egg, there's a little DIY gift inside. It's really cute. It's just like a little trinket that you can kind of build and make. So unfortunately, I already ate the chocolate and I already built it. So yeah, it's not in here, but that was in day 10. Day 11 to stand here. This is really cute. So this is a little eraser set, but it's in like the shape of fries. And he knows that I absolutely love fries. Potato is actually my favorite food ever. You can just make potato into anything. So that's why I love potatoes. And it's just so good. So he got me this little eraser set with Mickey Mouse on it. And they're just like in a little fry cup. Day 12 is down here. And here we have the rose hand cream. And I've almost used this up. I've used this so much. And I've just popped it back in just because I wanted to show you guys. But this is the rose hand cream from Lossetane. So I'd highly recommend this scent. And the packaging of it is really pretty too. Next up is 13. Oh, I forgot about this. This is the Pusheen Cat, but in a little beauty blender. It's not beauty blender brand, but it's just like a little makeup sponge. I was actually surprised he knew what this was. And he's like, yeah, of course, I've seen you do your makeup before and you use like a sponge. So yeah, this was really sweet of him to get me a little Pusheen cat. It's not actually on the sponge itself, but it's just the packaging, but it's in the same gray tone that Pusheen is. So yeah, that's him there at the back. Really, really cute little kitty. So day 14 is just here. And in day 14, we have a decent sized lotion. So this is also in the rose scent from L'Occitane. And I haven't used this yet, but look how pretty the color is. So day 15 is just down here. And here we have a little travel size of the cherry blossom lotion. And this is like the shimmering lotion. So it's got like little shimmer particles in it, which is really pretty. So next is day 16, which is up here. And inside we have a, another hand cream, but this is by Innisfree and this is really cute. So it's called the Small Wedding Bouquet. And he said he got this because there's a girl in a wedding dress there and he thought of me because we just got married and that was really, really sweet. Day 17's over here and we have another hand cream. So this is by Fredia again, and this is in the peach scent. So this is really pretty, like cute, pink packaging. Day 18 is down here. And this is really cute. So he's popped a little pouch that one of the items must have come with. So I think he got like a couple of sets, which is why like the L'Occitane, there's like a few different like shower gels and lotions and hand creams and it came like a set. So I can't remember which one this one's for, but he got this little pouch and he saved it and put it one of the days, which is really sweet, really cute. It's just like a little travel bag and yeah, not much to it. And it's got really cute patterns all around it. So day 19 is just up here. And here we have a, another hand cream, but this is in the cherry blossom scent by L'Occitane. And this is such a cute little size compared to like the other sizes, which were I think like 15 mil, this is 10 mil. And this fits perfectly in like mini handbags. So I'd highly recommend this if you're looking for like a hand cream, but you want to carry a mini bag or micro or nano bag with you, this fits perfectly in every single bag or even in your pocket. It's really cute too. And then day 20 is a big drawer here, which we have. Oh, this was so cute. Okay, so here we have a machine like, I don't know what these are called, surprise minis, I guess, but they're ones where like, it's like a lucky dip and you just buy one box and you don't know what you're going to get. So there's like a whole array of different items and all of these drawers I opened together with Anthony and we opened this together and the theme of this is kind of like fast food machine theme. So there's like a taco cat, there's a fries cat, there's a milkshake cat, there's a hamburger cat, there's a hot dog cat. So I was really, really excited when I got this because I just love these little lucky draw dip things because you never know what you're going to get. And I, after looking at the photos, I was like, I really, really want the fries one because as you guys know, I love fries. And lo and behold, what I got is the fry one. How cute is that? So it's the little machine cat in a little tub of fries and how cute. And he's holding one chip. He's like trying to stop it from falling out. It's so cute. So this is just like a little figurine. It's nothing like you don't do anything with it. It's just really cute to have and 
yeah, once you get one, it's really addictive and you kind of want to collect them all, but you just don't know which one you're going to get. So that's how you kind of get suckered into buying more than you actually need or like have to collect. I don't even have the urge to buy more because I got the one that I want and I'm happy with this one. So we're coming close to the end now. So day 21, we have drawer full of EOS balms and these are so cute. He got me three EOS balms and they're all in different scents. And how cute are these? I, it's been forever since I last used an EOS balm, but they're so cute and just like really novelty to have. They're like little eggs. So this one is in the scent Vanilla Bean. This one is in Strawberry Sorbet and this one is in Sweet Mint. So I've been using the Sweet Mint one and it just looks like this. So it's like a little ball and you kind of just put it on your lips and you're good to go. It's just like a lip balm. So day 22 is just a small box over here. And inside we have the Rose Scented Perfume by L'Occitane. And this is in a really cute travel size. So I think Anthony got a couple of travel sets from L'Occitane and Fredia maybe a couple of others and just kind of scattered them around, which is really smart of him to do. Like I wouldn't even think to do that. And yeah, I use everything in these sets anyway. So this is what it looks like. It's so cute. Like look how tiny this bottle is. So this is also perfect for travel. So day 23 is just down here in a large drawer. So in here we have a little nail set and this is in the Disney animals with the 101 Dalmatians theme and it's so cute so it's got like a little nail buffer in the shape of Patch which is the little Dalmatian dog and it's got like a nail file, nail clippers and the little separators as well so this is such a cute little set and even like the hanging part of it has like a little dog bone which is really cute so yeah even this little pouch like see-through pouch is good for travel as well if you just wanted to put a few things in here and the very last drawer for this advent calendar is in day 24 and inside he is definitely saved the best till last so in day 24 we have a little box so this is from pigeonhole inside are a really really cute pair of earrings so these are cherry blossom earrings so we've got like the pink, the really light pink enamel in the shape of a cherry blossom. It's so, so cute. And yeah, these are really pretty. He knows I absolutely love cherry blossoms, as you saw with all the hand creams and shower gels. So yeah, this it was in day 24, so Christmas Eve. And then after all of that, on Christmas Day, he actually surprised me with a actual Christmas present. So he said these were just like fun little things that you could open up every day and kind of enjoy as little gifts leading up to Christmas. But he actually got me a proper Christmas gift and it's in this bag here. So it looks like the Hermes bag, but it's actually from Inku, which is like an international brand store in Australia. I think I'm not sure if they have any other parts, other if they're open in any other parts of the world, but they stock a lot of like international brands where they don't have stores, standalone stores. But yeah, anyway, let's unbox this. So inside is just a box like this. So I'm sure you know by the shape of it what it could be. And it's by Gentle Monster. So if you know, you know. And I've been wanting these for such a long time. So this box is really hard to open. Like you never know where to open it from, but so it just opens like that. And then inside are a pair of sunglasses. So it comes in a sunglasses case and this is actually really cool. It's got like a really fun texture to it. It's like, I don't even know what this is. So it just says gentle monster there. And it's a very futuristic looking sunglasses case. I've never seen anything like it. So inside it's got like a magnetic popper, magnetic closure. And here we have the sunglasses that Anthony got me for Christmas. So these are the Gentle Monster Her sunglasses. And I've been wanting these for such a long time. They've just been like really hard to find. Like I didn't even know Inku stocked it. I really, really wanted to get these when we were in Hawaii. I was hoping because we were in the US, maybe they would have them in stock, but I just couldn't find them anywhere in any department store. I don't think they stocked Gentle Monster. So yeah, even then it was really hard to find and he knew that I really wanted them. So he got them for me for Christmas and these are amazing, like these shades. And he actually really likes the look of them too. He loves how like it's flat, like the lens just kind of goes all across there. And the one thing I love about Gentle Monster sunglasses, because they are made in South Korea, they kind of cater to Asian face shapes, I guess. They've got like a really high nose. I don't know what these are called, but like, the little nose rests they're a lot 
higher like thicker so they sit higher on the nose because my nose is quite flat or like the bridge of it is quite flat so I need sunglasses either with like the little I don't even know what they're called but yeah the one the things that kind of rest on your nose so yeah I'll pop them on and show you guys what they look like so they just look like that and they sit so nicely on my face and they don't touch rest on my cheeks or anything they sit perfectly on my nose and yeah I just love the way that they like look they're very big very bam very like celebrity style kind of sunglasses yeah i love these and i just love that they're all black and the little detail is actually in rose gold so gentle monster on the arms of the sunglasses and then there's like little rose gold dots metal dots on the sides so in the box it just came with a plastic cover so the sunglasses were in here when i received them and also it came with a cleaning cloth and the little case so yeah that is everything that anthony or my husband or hubby got me for christmas it's still so weird saying husband but yeah that's everything that he got me for christmas last year and it's just so so thoughtful i just really want to do like a quick video just to share with you guys because i thought it was just so sweet of him and i just wanted to share it with you guys but yeah that's all for today's video i really hope you guys enjoyed it if you did please don't forget to like and click that notification bell so that you're notified when i upload my next video i have a lot more content planned so stay tuned for that but until then i'll see you in my next video bye